I was in Korea and Sawyer Brown had just won some big TV show and they were touring all over Korea. And I just remember thinking, God, this is awesome because it felt like, it felt like there was a little bit of home there for a few minutes, you know? And no regrets. I remember that feeling that I felt standing down there looking up. I remember the feeling that I felt when I was a, the head of security for a particular dignitary that would come over. And now I go over and I get that same treatment from these guys and it's super weird. Uh, you know, I mean, many times on USO tours in Afghanistan, there's two or three of them with us and it's their sole responsibility. I know, I know because I've done that job and they will not let me, they try so hard to not let me out of their sight, but because I've done that job, I know what they have to do and I get away from them every time. It's so much fun because they get so freaked out and they're so nervous. But we have a lot of fun with that now. And now they all know that, so when I go over, it's, it's like the big thing now to not let me get out of their sight. <laughs> when I go to Iraq and Afghanistan, I come home every time and I've got about a three week pouting period that my wife says that she don't even hardly talk to me because I'm gripey and edgy, but it's because I wanna go back. Every soldier says that and it's the reality of their life. I think looking back, the thing you miss the most is the camaraderie, the esprit de corps. There's not a corporation in America. There's no company that you can work for there's no business, there's nothing that you will do where you will share the same sense of loyalty and esprit de corps uh, like you do in the military.